second chapter. Lesson number six. The various elements of your show, the gradient. In this lesson, we will see how to create a layer of color gradient, or gradient, as well as how to change to achieve the desired effect. But what is a gradient? A layer of gradient type is basic rectangular layer consisting of one or more color gradients, whether linear, circular, or any other form. The gradient is often used as wallpaper, frame border, or as a mask, allowing then an infinity of possible effect on one, or many, in which he applied layers. You will see in the next few lessons, it is often requested, and, in multiple forms and uses. Now see the principle of create it. As with all types of layers, open the drop-down menu to add layer, and select the option. Add Gradient. Upon selection, the window for creating gradients will open. It is named, Gradient. It consists of seven parts. We will detail one by one. The first left is the selection box predefined colors. This is the list, preset. To the right of its name, you have two command icons for editing the list. The first, the plus, added to the list in use, the type of gradient currently visible, and create a new icon for it, it was last added to the list. The second, the symbol minus, clears the currently selected type in the area of choice. The choice selected and surrounded by a red outline. Just below, you have a drop-down menu, allows you to choose different types of color gradient. For the moment, we are on the selection simple. Open the drop-down menu, and see the different types of available colors. In order, we have, Spectrum, which contains styles representing a spectra of colors, or the diamond glints. The second, Metal, representing metallic reflections, gold, silver, and blue, in various aspects. Third, Pastel, is composed of a series of pastel color mixes the name suggests. Fourth, simple, consists of a simple mixture of two colors of the same tone, go for clear, or to dark. Fifth, special effect, is composed of a variety of different mixture, multi-step gradient. Sixth, semi-transparent, is composed of gradient starting for color and go to transparent, or, vice versa. And finally, the last, Mask contains single or multiple effects, black and white gradient, very useful as a basis for creating a mask. Select the first of the list, the gradient from white to black, linear, by clicking it. Once this is done, the gradient will appear in the window of preview, the top center window. We define the basic colors we want, or more or less, we will see later how to refine, modify or add. Now see the shape of our gradient. For the moment, it is linear. Therefore from a color to the second on straight line. In the tab, gradient type at top right, you can select different type of shape gradient. To do so, just click to open the drop down menu under the title of the tab. There are six different types. The first, linear, as we have said, going in a straight line from one color to another and the second radial gradient made in concentric circles from the center of the screen to the edges. Third, angular, creates a gradient like a clock, starting from a specific time, with the first color, turning counterclockwise, to return start position with the end color. Fourth, rectangular, creates a gradient of concentric rectangles, identical to the scale of your layer, starting from the center to the edges. Fifth, Damon shape gives a similar effect to the radial effect, coupled with a bright of color center. Interesting example for the creation of a star effect. Finally the last, Plasma, creates a gradient effect with respect to a predefined layer. We will see later how to change it. Keep the type linear selected for the moment. Just below this insert, you have tab, Gradient setting. 
It is composed of four orders of training. First, resolution allows you to resize your gradient to the size of your choice. For example, create a square shape gradient. Change the value of x, the first for her to have the same value as a Greek. Same as, 720 by 720. The size is expressed in pixels, not screen percentage. See the result in the window provided. Your gradient is now square shaped, and the edge to edge with the horizontal boundaries. Click anti-clockwise arrow to reset the defaults. Second, position is only available with four types of gradients. The radial, the angular, the rectangular and the diamond shaped. In the window gradient type, select the type, radial. You will notice that now the position values are accessible. They are base 50 by 50. These value are they expressed in percentage of screen, and sets the starting position center at the gradient in your layer. For the x-axis, 0% is the left edge of your show, and the 100% value of the right edge. For abscess I Greek, 0% value is at the upper edge, and the 100% value, the lower edge of your show. This is specific to gradients, because you are impaired for positioning of any other items, the center of your show corresponding to 0 of 0%. Enter a value of 0 inches both fields digital, or move the two trimmings cursor these values to their extreme left. You will notice that now the starting center of your gradient is at the top left corner of your show. Also notice that your gradient is also modified so that the end color matches always with the or all farthest corners from the position of starting color. Click the arrow counterclockwise to reset position to its default values. Third, angle is also only accessible for two types of gradient and its behavior is different for both. The first type for which this command is available is the type linear. It allows you to choose the direction of your gradient. At zero degrees, it is perfectly horizontal, starting from the left edge, ending at the right edge. The rotation is based on trigonometric, and therefore the counterclockwise. If you open the cursor control this value by clicking on the digital box it, and move it from the extreme left to the extreme right, you will rotate your gradient of a full turn in the counterclockwise. By default, the angular value of a linear gradient of 332 degrees. The second type of gradient for which this value is also accessible in Turk is the type, angular. Original, the value of angle is 0 degrees, and the positions of start and end equal 9 hours on the clock. Rotation is also done counterclockwise, thus, for example, 90 degrees, the starting position is 6 hours on a clock. The fourth and final command, seed, which could translate by, shape of dispersion, is his only accessible for type, plasma. It contains the model number of the seed used. By default, this is the type number zero is selected. To modify the effect or, you enter the desired value in the digital area, or, you click on the button, random, to randomly select a value. Make several click on it, to get a preview of this command. For example, see the effect obtained with the value, 19169. Now go back to the type linear, in default resolution, and add an angle of 0 degrees. In the second part, we will see how to change the color of your gradient, and personalize with the fourth insert. Thank you for your attention.